yeah, no, nobody really, <coughs> yeah, nobody really knew the guy really. Uh, he just sort of stuff started showing up everywhere. Nobody knew his name, where he was from. I started to see his work all over the place, mm, mostly in bathrooms, bathroom stores, toilets, tires. There really isn't a, a way I could really describe his work other than uh, it's, it's just sort of rude. I guess people started calling it art. Uh, I guess that makes me an artist. You know, to tell you the truth, nobody in the graffiti uh, community really paid much attention to the guy. Uh, it really wasn't until he actually started calling our work gay. He would uh, write it all over our work, which is uh, very offensive because I am not gay. Not that I would not be gay, I would totally be gay. If I was gay, I would be happy to be gay, but I am not gay. I mean, even my brother is gay, and I kissed him once to prove that we, I am not gay. Uh, he is gay, but not me. Oh no. <laughs> he was writing gay on everything that Space Invader was doing, and then, of course, once I was with Space Invader, everything I was doing. I was like, what the fuck is going on? I thought, you know, that nobody was allowed to do this. I think that a lot of them are just probably jealous. You know, people want other people to know that when they when they call something gay, there's other people out there with them, you know. It, the scene just sort of blew up. It was weird because everyone sort of looked to me like I, I, you know, like I knew what was going on. I was just one guy out there calling everything gay. There's a lot of things I don't, a lot of things I don't like, and then there's, um, you know, there's, there's a lot I don't understand, and that's pretty much when my work's at its best. It only took about a month of hearing about this guy before uh, his work started appearing in odd galleries. I never really took any of my work too seriously, uh, you know, but and then I realized, hey, I could, I could take this and, and move it into other arenas. I mean, there, there's a lot of stuff out there that should be called gay. He just sort of showed up and broke all the rules. Then again, I've always said there were no rules. So I don't know. He used to think, tell everybody, you know, they should make their own art. And uh, now, you know, I don't really tell people that anymore. You know, if, there, if there's one thing I sort of learned from this whole experience, is that life is really just full of surprises. And the majority of those surprises are actually pretty gay.